62 caps for Bafana Bafana, two World Cups. He was there in 2002 at uh, Korea, Japan, played three games at that World Cup, played uh, a game in the 2010 World Cup and was crucial in us winning that. We'll talk about that crucial moment. Uh, that's coming up in the conversation as well. Many years in Russia, winning league titles there. One of the greats of South African football, but probably also one of the players that were most undervalued by South Africans because he wasn't tricky, he wasn't skillful. He just won us the ball, got it back, kicked everybody, and then let us play. Macbeth Sibaya alongside his wife, Nikki, for Valentine's Day. For those of you who want to get to 10 years of marriage and live under the limelight and the spotlight of being superstars, this is where we're going to get the tips. So stay with us as we have that conversation. Nikki. We're going to ignore him for a little while. <laughs> it's just you and me having a conversation about being a wife of a footballer who's played overseas. How hard is that? Um, it's very hard. It's, Why? It's not what I had expected. Uh, when I first met him, he said he was a golfer. <laughs> <laughs> um, surprise, surprise. Uh? Um, yeah, it, it's... It's not what I had expected, but it, it was some valued number of years and, yeah. Ten years of marriage now, according yeah. to us. Yeah. I know your number, because we had a little conversation, was slightly different. Yeah. I was like, December, you guys celebrated ten years. Mm. You're like, ah. And then the two of you got out calculators and worked out, what's the official number? It's 11. But why Minangazi 10? Ngoba, it's for Nina. Tina says, yeah. And that was a year before? Yeah. Okay, so how did you meet the golfer, Macbeth Sibaya? <laughs> <sighs> yeah, ne? Um, I met him while I was coming back from school. Um, that was... Yeah, I'm just ready. Yeah, I'm just ready. I'm just ready. I'm just ready. Yeah, now he was across the road with his friends. With his friend and he saw me. He ran across the road. He chatted me up. I was speaking, I was with my friend. And I didn't speak to him. I wasn't interested. Oh my begati, how about na mushiman ubali? Zwanu ngamo na kabali. You obvious. Eh. I mean, yeah. Sheba, what toes? Alo toes. What toes? I need threads. It's a. I need threads. It's a. Yeah. And then um, he he gave he put his telephone number in my blazer pocket. Hey, isn't that the hala man? Hey. I'm going to move to the house. I'm going to go to the Instagram. I'm going to go to the <laughs> Nothing. Cell phone. <laughs> so we are bad. And then I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go I had told him where I lived. So he came by a month later. How serious is it? Too much. How much on the first day? It's. When it's true, then. Can I make him beg? But I don't know if I can go in. The time in Clanton. Yeah, when it's where I end up not going to where, where I was going. Uh -huh. So I decided no. Rather this, talk. Rather, rather talk, and I think this is it. This already? Already. Yeah. Day one, you, but it took you a month to go to figure who you man. No, no, because I was uh, I was still in Durban where uh, there was a uh, we had a break at Cosmos because I was still with the juniors uh. at the time. So when I come back, I went to see her. So I used to be trouble because the uh, more figure my flat in you have to pass. So her mother answered, yo. She started shouting, "Why do you hunt with my child? Go away!" Uh. <laughs> so I went to. Away, fetch another friend with, with a softer voice. Uh, <laughs> 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 oh, was a charmer, uh, Softer voice, uh, a lady. Ah. Uh, uh, so and I told her to ask for Nikki. Uh, and her mother, her mother answered, then uh, as she asked for Nikki, and she went to the intercom, and I asked her, I'm downstairs. That guy you met the other time. <laughs> baza, baza, kuluma. So she came down, she was, she was busy studying for her exams. Uh -huh. So she came down and uh, asked, her, asked her out for movies. And she said, I must come back in like two hours. And we went to the movies. How long then, if you've been married 11 years, how long in total 
have you guys been together? 20. Hmm. That's 20 years. 20. Yep. And he met you. I just listened now. So you guys met when you were still at Cosmos. Yep. You weren't at Cosmos for long because right after what, a year or two of Cosmos, you then went to Norway. No, a couple of months I went to Hungary. Hungary? Yeah. yeah. Then to Norway. Yeah, then the World, World Cup, Cup and then Norway. Then Norway. Okay, she even knows every story. Yeah. So when you're leaving to go to all these other countries, how does the relationship stay strong and straight together? It stayed. Yeah, Afa. No, it stayed. It's like but how? What it do you just, do? It, it just... I think, uh, I think the, um, is the, is the ambitions that we had together, you know? Every time I went, I went to see her after school and we sit in the bus stops, we begin to talk, you know, you know, what she would like to achieve, what uh. I would like to achieve. And uh, even, uh, even our dream cars, when we're sitting in the bus stop, we say, this one. <laughs> Same dream car? Yes. We got all of that. You did and it the all? House. Yeah. Huh? And, and the house. And the house. So yeah. all those dreams yeah. that you used to dream together as youngsters 20 years ago, you spoke about them, you articulated them, yeah. you shared them, and you worked towards making them happen. Yeah. Even the kids as well. Mm. Even how many yeah. kids you're going to have, all of Not that. Not necessarily how many. We didn't specify the numbers, on the number, how many kids that we're going to have. But uh, we, we just like the idea of having a family. The one thing you didn't really help him with, though, Nikki, was goals. You want to make better than a girl? Better than a girl? No, better girl. I go. Ah, no matter what, no girl in the world can win. Four goals. Imagine the Barcelona. No matter what, no girl. No, four goals in four goals in eight years in Russia, and then go PSL. I got a guy one, 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 2011 uh, against uh, Super Sport. I learned as well. Guy one. Eh eh. Don't go to me now. You know, you know, that my girl is young. Thomas and I were going to have a call. I went. I went. I got a call. Let's go, Smuggin King. Striker. I'm really going to have a call. Okay. No, you're going to have a call. Nikki, did Macbeth ever feel frustrated with South Africans that we just never showed him? The love, you know that love, because he was a hard guy. He was the guy who just kicks and gets the ball and wins it. And we just never, you know, that love that they give to that skillful guy. Did he ever come home and say, they don't appreciate me? Um, I really can't answer that because he didn't bring his work home with him. Home life was home life. Mm. Uh, home life is to enjoy, he, he never really came home and said anything about... But you could see, right? Yes, I could see, I could hear, I could read. Um, but I think we've always been Abantu just to look out for each other and just try and keep the... Or not try, but the mood is just calm. Mm. Macbeth, can I say on behalf of the South Africans, though, we really did appreciate you. We just didn't say it, you know? Those 62 caps and the performances you put in, two World Cups... We can never take that away. And the, the, the thi what you gave to this country was tremendous. Going to play in Russia for, what, like eight years? You know, flying the flag for the country. It must have been, though, it, it must be frustrating when you feel like I'm doing so much, right? And nobody's really just feeling me. No, yeah, not really. Because it's, it's, uh, it's one of the things I used to say when we have these meetings with Safa. Uh. That uh, I, I didn't come here for popularity, so... It's either they said they were constrained, that they don't have money, they won't pay us. I'll, uh. I'll still play. So <laughs> I, I never really, I was never really uh, that person who enjoys uh, to be in the limelight. Uh. So uh, because for me, football is just, just work, you know, pure just work. I, I didn't do it for anything else except I had ambitions that to, to play overseas and again to have a, have a, have a life. As Kulungay World Cup year 2010, 
we won a game in that World Cup against France. But that game, when we won it, if France be by 10 a grounding eventually, Tina's 11, because Gorkov gave you an elbow and then got sent off, red card, then we were able to destroy that French team. What did you say to him? Nothing. Because <laughs> Alkulumin is French. How do you get so, how does he get so angry as an elbow? Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't really know, but it is one of uh, one of the best games I've ever played for for the national team, and we had a long chat with uh, Pereira, uh, uh, the coach, prior to that game. Yeah, because I had an understanding uh, how things were set up, you know, who should play, who shouldn't play, but uh, was not really technical reasons, but. Uh, that's his story for, for, for another time. Because, uh, yeah, I told him if you want to win, win a game, this is how we should play. Luckily, other players, you know, they, got here, look, uh, they got suspension. They were on suspension. So we were able to play. One game. So, yeah, some game we did our part. And uh, fortunately, we won the game. And unfortunately, uh, we didn't score enough, enough goals. To go through? To go through, yeah. Yeah, I still want to know what T.Y. is ground in you. It was like shy, like shy, red card, World yeah, Cup. Four stitches. Stitches? Mm. Yeah, half time. Yeah? Mm. But he came home smiling, I'm a stitch. I was at the stadium. Yeah. I drove. She, I drove she drove to, everywhere. I drove to every game. game. Yeah. Every game? Yeah. There. I drove to, from Joburg to Bloom. Bloom to Joburg to go pick him up at camp. Uh, and went home. That was our life. But for what? You wouldn't want to be a con. Ah, I'm going to know one. Eh? Number one fan. Come to Wins and support. <laughs> yeah. This is it. I mean, this is perfect to hear. Guys, this is the Sport of 10 Cup. Ne? You can't have it, it's priceless. But you can have the cakes. And there's even one here with like a, let me show today. We've gone extra special. Oh. That one? a Valentine's Day heart on it and everything. But you need to get the quiz right. And the quiz is all a little bit about uh, sporting couples. <coughs> Great sporting couples, like yourselves. So, let's see if you can recognize them. First and foremost, Valentine's Day love. Who are these two? Yes. <laughs> and I, I can see. <laughs> okay, two great tennis players. They've got two kids, Steffi Graf, Andre Agassi. I get you. Okay, I see you got your sports there. Let's go to the next one. Can you recognize this sporting couple? Ali's daughter. Leila? Yes. Leila Ali? I lawyer, obvious. Everybody yeah. knows. And the other one? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> he, he's numbing on us. Curtis Conway is the husband. He plays American football and they have a son together. I didn't even know because I always had like a crash nyan on Layla. But oh. now she's married and stuff, so good rough. I saw organized. Oh, have a Thank crush you. on the box. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not going to I'm not And then last one. Layla's going to pressure because if you don't come up with this name, Macbeth, hi, yeah, yeah. Oh, who's, God. <laughs> <laughs> who's the guy? At least the girl we are, but the guy. Bayern Munich. Schweinsteiger. Yes, Bastian Schweinsteiger. <laughs> uh, yeah. And then the wife, well, girlfriend, she's pregnant, kid, oh. tennis player. Oh, no. no idea. No. no. Anna Ivanovic, former world number ah. one. Yabon. And you watch tennis, don't yes. lie, right? You do. Yeah. When Magan Koga is in Desi White and what? Uh, mm -mm. Not anymore. No. But do you know we... the Williams, they take all the. Attention. Yeah, but uh, yeah. not anymore. Yeah, but it's yeah, a it matter still. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? Cupcaking? Yeah, no, it's, it's, valen it's Valentine's. For love. Yeah, we're just gonna, we're just okay, gonna give. Please, I, I'm gonna please. give it to the sister. I don't know. Tell us about the plan. Please. Okay, it's a plan. Okay, it's a plan. Sister, kids. Hello. And I'm comparing with the little sister. Did you like him better than the dress or not? Because the truth will set you free. The dress and the dinner are the best thing. Did you like him better than the dress or? And I can't like it, I can't like it. Oh, really? Hey. So disappointed. Oh. Oh, boy. 
want to move on a bona, but Joe is Valentine's and everything. I didn't have a choice. Didn't have Who a choice? made you take them off? No pant. Hey? No pant. Oh, it's sunroof. Oh, it's sunroof. It's Oh, okay, okay. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, it's Valentine's Day, man. Whoever, if you have your person, please hug them properly. Thomas, I always say Steve Compella is dark until I saw Sienda Cool. You mean a long time, Yama, or not a mood? Where's Ugar one meal? Mara, I'm just saying, just for control. See you guys at my show, 24th February. Please, you guys come. Thank you, guys. Cool. And then you're allowed to say you love her, right? Just leave. Yes, just, just for you're allowed control. To say I'll sing. Right? You do, when right? I, when I keep saying, I'll sing. He's not going to say it on TV. He's a Zulu man. We're going to leave you with the words that we always do. <laughs> if you're not watching Sport at 10, <laughs> what are you doing? Good night.